Hey, we have a little caterpillar here. And as you can see, there are some numbers inside this caterpillar. So we can see the number 10, the number 11, the number 14, the number 16, the number 18, and the number 20. And then there are some circles in this caterpillar that are not filled in, they're blank. And what we have to do is fill in, fill in the missing numbers. And we're gonna do that by doing a number line and the number line is going to help us figure out what numbers are missing. So let's start with the first number in this caterpillar, and that number is a number 10. Let's do a number line starting at the number 10. So I'm gonna draw a big number line out like this. It's the big number okay, line. and we're gonna draw a number line, and we're gonna start it at 10, and actually let me, let me do a different color so it's easier to see the numbers in the number line. So I'm gonna pick how about this color, this light blue, this turquoise color? So what number comes after 10 in the number line? Do you know? It's 11. And after 11, what comes next? 12. 12. And after 12, what comes next? 13. 13. And after 13, what comes next? 14. 14. Mm -hmm. And after 14, what comes next? 15. 15. And after 15, what comes next? 16. 16. And after 16, what comes next? 17. 17. And after 17, what comes next? 18. 18. And after 18, what comes next? 19. 19. After 19, what comes next? 20. 20. And we can even keep going. Do you know what comes after 20? 21. 21. And what comes after 21? 22. 22. And what comes after 22? 22. 23. And what comes after 23? 24. 24. And let's put one more just for fun. What comes after 24 in the number line? 25. 25. So you can see the number line allows us to go forwards and we can always go backwards too with the number line. So now let's try to fill in the missing numbers and we we'll use a number line to help us. So for example, we see 10. We can kind of see that there's 10 right here. And what comes next after 10 is 11. And I'm going to use a different color to show that. 11. And then what comes after 11? 12. 12. So we can actually fill in the number 12 as the first missing number. Then what comes after 12 on a number 13. line? It's 13. So we can put the number 13 here. And then after 13 comes 14. 14. And after 14 comes 15. 15 right there. 15. And then we already have 16 written here, but let's draw an arrow just for fun anyway. 16 right here. Okay, how about here? After 16, what comes next? We can say 16. Then 17 comes next after 16. So we can say 17. And after 17, what comes next? So after 17, we see 18. And we already have that filled in. And after 18, what comes next? 19. 18 plus 1 is 19, and we can see that right there. Right there, we've got 19. And then after 19, what comes next on the number line? It's 20. 20 comes next after 19 That's on the number line. Left off, but we can go more for fun. Yeah, exactly. We, were, we already finished the problem that was being posed to us because the problem was just to fill in the missing numbers in this caterpillar. We filled in all the missing numbers, but you can see, you can keep going with the number line. So after 20, what comes next on the number line after 20? It's 21. 21 comes next after 20. And after 21, what comes next? 22. 22 comes next. And after 22, what comes next? 23. 23 comes next. And after 23, what comes next? 24. 24 comes next. And what comes next after 24? 25. And we we're going to stop it. here at 25. We did it. You can even keep going. The number line keeps going forever. But for this problem, we were able to stop at 25 and fill in all the blanks. In fact, we could have stopped earlier. Do you know where we could have stopped? How far do we need to go on this number line to fill this problem in, to complete this problem? 20. Right. If we had stopped the number line right here at 20, right here at 20, we would have all the information we needed to complete this problem. We did some extra just for fun. We didn't need to do it, but it helped us to better understand the number line.
Gus did Jenny Five for fun because um we wanted to make a full number one. We could have just stopped at twenty so we could have all the information. But that's to know our numbers in case we forget we did twenty five just for fun. Thank you everybody. Hey, thank you. Hope you join us for future videos. At dot com.